the new research program of the EU allows for the development of new technologies, uh, existing technologies and emerging technologies, which would allow to massively reduce the use of animals and ultimately to replace the use of animals if the member state will allocate the money in the correct way and develop this program which are already used, for example, in the United States and in other countries such as Japan. Uh, Gaia, why these animal tests are not good for us? Why this, uh, this new program emerged? We now know that it's necessary to shift to a 21st century science and technological tool to ensure that the testing that is done on chemical compounds for pharmaceutical use or for biomedic biomedicine research will be done in a human relevant way. What does it mean human relevant? Because were animal tests not relevant? Why, why this question emerged? Because uh, drugs and also cosmetics were always tested on animals previously. Today we have evidence, scientific evidence, saying that uh, any, uh, the testing that is done on animals is poorly limited, uh, relevant for the humans. So rather than keep going and studying the animals, since we're not rats and we're not um, dogs, we can now use new tools which are directly um, studying the humans, such as genomics, genetics, bioengineering, uh, system biology, and new branches of disciplines which is called human biology-based research. In 2004, the Food and Drug Administration, uh, the agency from the US government, has published a report saying that nine out of 10 cases of drug testing on animals um, were failing when uh, translated on humans. So the failure rate of using animals for trying to replicate what could happen on humans is extremely high, it's very expensive. It takes, for example, about 10 years to develop one single drug with such a high level failure rate and the future human on a chip that will replace the outdated animal test